Welcome to the Natural Health Show with one of New England's leading holistic specialists, Mark Mincola. Call Mark at 617-822-1969 on 96.9 Boston Talks. Welcome home, Natural Health Nation. Great to have you on board this spectacular summer Sunday. Hope everybody's feeling great and uh, not stressed. Hope you're, <laughs> hope you're uh, enjoying a stress free weekend and a stress-free Sunday afternoon. And, uh, you know, it's um, really amazing when you, when you sort of think about the amount of stress that we contend with and the amount of uh, dis-ease and disease that it contributes to in our culture. Unfortunately, these uh, bad economic times don't make stress any easier either. So uh, it seems like those issues are really uh, expanding these days. But I wanted to talk uh, this evening about an interesting recent Harris a uh, poll of 7,600 Americans, a, a survey, rather, of 7,600 Americans. 75% of American workers feel burned out uh, due to what they refer to as unmanageable stress. You know, there are some really uh, remarkable, remarkable stories all throughout this great country out there about folks working a, a number of jobs and trying to kind of keep up, like we said, with a, a very uh, difficult economy right now, etc. But uh, the amount of unmanageable stress, that's an interesting term, the amount of unmanageable stress that is uh, befalling so many of us these days. It's always been a stressful thing to survive in this world, but it seems like there are times that are perhaps more difficult than others, and these are clearly those times for so many of us. And uh, stress and burnout certainly play their significant role in our health and lack thereof. Uh, so we want to talk about stress and burnout this evening and what it's doing to your health and what you could do about it because clearly there are natural solutions. And uh, per usual here on the Natural Health Show, uh, I'm here to help you with your Q&A responses as well. So n needless to say, if you have questions on any natural health topic, any vitamin, mineral questions, um, any questions regarding the natural approach to health-related issues that you may be confronted with. Well, that's what I'm here for. So in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, it's a free call. Just dial pound 96.9. And of course, stress is a natural part of of day-to-day -day life. Stress produces physical and hormonal and chemical changes in our bodies. But again, it's really an important point to remember here that not all stress is bad. Okay, there are some stresses that actually have a way to kind of motivate our creativity, uh, keep us in the zone, keep us on the edge. So not all stress has a negative effect. Uh, stress and burnout is a whole different Reality, however, burnout is a term uh, which describes the uh, sort of uh, emotional, mental, and physical exhaustion experienced by those of us who are overworked, overwhelmed, and overstressed. And as we said here, the recent Harris poll of 7,600 Americans indicates that indeed we are, because that poll found that 75% of American workers feel burned out uh, due to un manageable stress. So burnout is indeed the end result of unmanageable stress when it hits high levels. Uh, excessive workload, lack of personal control over life and lifestyle issues, lack of recognition, lack of clarity, lack of opportunity, conflict. These are all some of the reasons given by the recent Harris poll for workers feeling overextended, exhausted, and immersed in what they refer to as unmanageable stress. And the end product of unmanageable stress, depression, anxiety, lack of energy, uh, appetite imbalances. Some folks during periods of acute stress, uh, their appetite will peak. They eat out of control. They eat as uh, a means of trying to alleviate their stresses. Other folks, however, will eat less, lose their appetite, and uh, lose weight, and uh, unfortunately gain risk factors for a variety of illnesses. And again, all stress will do that very thing. We mentioned anxiety, depression, physical exhaustion. We mentioned, we mentioned lack of energy. These are all things that so many of us are unfortunately not 
unfamiliar with. So the good news, however, is there really are indeed solutions. We're going to talk a lot about those solutions. There are natural approaches to offsetting the ravages of a burnout and the ravages of stress. And again, phone numbers in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call pound 969. Now, when you think about getting up in the morning, especially on a Monday morning, it's uh, sometimes real difficult. But you know, uh, a lot of the, re the uh, recent research indicates that at 9 o'clock, you've heard this, most of you, that 9 o'clock on a Monday morning, is unfortunately the time where many of those emergency rooms are uh, overloaded with folks that have suffered some form of heart attack. And that's not an untruth. Unfortunately, it is a truth. And I think there are two reasons for it. I think uh, the reason number one, of course, is the amount of cortisol that is produced early in the morning, especially when you're getting up for work on that Friday, uh, that uh, Monday morning, rather. There's a tremendous amount of tension, tremendous amount of stress, anticipation, etc. Um, I think there's another reason for it as well. I think on the weekends, during periods of excessive stress, people really decompress to offset the ravages of their Monday through Friday tensions. So more often than not, uh, the kind of adult beverages and the uh, and the ex excessive uh, intake of tobaccos, et cetera, et cetera, will often play their part in this whole process of stress uh, moving into the cell level. So there's a variety of ways that stress moves into our lives. There's a variety of affect at a cellular level, not just talking about thoughts and emotions here. We're talking about what stress does and burnout does to the human body. And what it does in terms of influencing our choices and our behaviors uh, with regards to uh, the bad choices with foods, etc. So uh, these are not uncommon for any of us. I mean, again, the weekend is a time where an awful lot of people are just really cutting loose because it is so wound tight and so tense Monday through Friday that we can sometimes... Uh, find our, we find ourselves in weekends going a little bit the other way too far, but uh, not unusual. A lot of drinking, a lot of uh, drugging in many cases, etc. So we are very, very stressed. And according to this recent Harris survey, very uh, burned out society. And uh, again, with the economy being what it is right now, things are unfortunately not getting a whole lot better when it comes to stress and burnout. So again, the, the best news of all is there are some really important, natural, viable functional solutions. There are some supplements that I'm going to mention. There are some uh, nutritional suggestions that I'm going to mention as well. And uh, we're going to talk about those uh, this evening. And again, our, our lines are open for you to call in to ask questions about stress in your life, nutritional questions, natural medicine questions, solutions for your stress issues, for body, mind, and spirit. And uh, again, any of those questions or any questions that you may have regarding your most recent trip to the health food stores, the shelves of those health food stores and what they hold, how you can make better use of natural supplements, dieting, etc. So we're here for those particular questions in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, it is a free call, just dial pound 969. And again, you're listening to The Natural Health Show. My name is Mark Mincola. We'll be right back right after these messages. Stay tuned. Listen, 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 interact, 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 view, view, engage, live, live. 969bostontalks.com. Hi, this is Laura from Good Health. We all know that excessive unprotected sun exposure can lead to premature aging of the skin. This means more wrinkles, sunspots, and fine lines. More than 2 million Americans in the U.S. will be diagnosed with skin cancer this year alone. The good news is astaxanthin and new oral supplements made from fern may potentially guard against UV skin damage. Our holistic skincare products from Derma E, Andalou, and My Shell contain plant extracts and potent antioxidants like astaxanthin and pycnogenol to block free radicals and reduce cell damage caused from excessive sun. Remember, for complete protection in the garden, on the golf course, beach, or boat, you can protect your skin against premature aging and skin cancer. Visit Good Health in Quincy and Hanover for clean, organic skin care, sunscreens, and supplements. Learn more about all our healing products at goodhealthnaturalfood.com. Be smart, enjoy your summer sun safely, and thanks for listening. 
The brain requires nutrition just like the rest of the body. Although many of us depend upon caffeine for focus and concentration, caffeine is not actually a nutrient. Real nutrition is needed to enhance brain metabolism and provide antioxidant protection. This is where Jaro Formula's Neuro Optimizer comes to the rescue. Neuro Optimizer is a concentrated source of the nutrients needed for memory and mood, for concentration and focus, all without being a stimulant. Neuro Optimizer supplies the building blocks for neurotransmitters, the chemicals that allow cells in the brain to communicate and to file away memories. Acetyl-L-carnitine and alpha-lipoic acid support brain energy production. Phosphatidylserine, L-glutamine and taurine enhance brain stability and detoxification in the face of stress. Neuro Optimizer is the nutritional answer to the brain's needs. Ask for Neuro Optimizer at your local health food store or for more information, go to Jaro.com. That's J-A-R-R-O-W for the best in brain health formulas. Join Joan Borisenko Sunday, August 7th at 2 o'clock at the Holiday Inn in Rockland. Joan Borisenko is acknowledged as one of the world's greatest leaders and distinguished pioneers in integrative medicine and the mind-body connection. Joan Borisenko's groundbreaking book, Minding the Body, Mending the Mind, revolutionized awareness of the mind-body connection. Now, Joan's new book, Fried, Why You Burn Out and How to Thrive, is here. Joan will share up-to-the-minute spiritual inspiration coming from her own process in a unique presentation. Reviving Your Life. Register for Joan Borisenko at MyHealthyLivingMag.com. General admission is just $39. Program begins at 2 p.m. Call 781-834-2728 for tickets. 781-834-2728. Learn how to revive your own life energy. See Joan Borisenko live Sunday, August 7th at the Holiday Inn in Rockland. Register online at MyHealthyLivingMag.com. MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Now, back to The Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. In Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, lucky guys and gals, free call pound 96.9. And again, you just heard that uh, recent uh, ad for Joan Borisenko. Joan Borisenko, of course, uh, the uh, Revive Your Life presentation will be uh, next Sunday, which is August 7th, you just heard uh, at the Holiday Inn in Rockland from 2 to 5. And uh, Joan is remarkable. She is a distinguished pioneer in integrated medicine. She is a noted author and lecturer who has uh, managed to bring spirit, science, medicine, and psychology together. And uh, she's a world-renowned expert in mind-body medicine. And uh, had a New York Times bestseller. Uh, Mining the Body, Mending the Mind, sold 400,000 copies of that particular book, and she's authored and co-authored 13 additional books. So uh, that's going to be a wonderful, wonderful presentation. Anybody that's never heard Joan speak, you're going to want to make sure you're there. So again, that's uh, next Sunday, August 7th, at the Holiday Inn in Rockland from 2 to 5. Revive Your Life, and her recent book, (laughs) Why You Burn Out and How to Revive. (laughs) That seems like it's uh, right on point here with tonight's show. So uh, perfectly timed, and uh, you really want to learn from an expert how not to burn out, or better yet, um, how to revive and resuscitate your life, body, mind, and spirit with natural means. We're going to certainly talk to you this evening about how to do that uh, from a perspective of nutrition and uh, supporting your chemistry, but uh, a great, great mind-body approach to the very same thing. So again, if you're among the 75% that's a remarkable thing. Again, that this Harris poll, this Harris survey, rather, that we've been talking about this evening, uh, of 7,600 Americans suggesting that 75% of workers feel burned out due to unmanageable stress. And uh, again, when, when you think about the fact that uh, there's an excessive workload that's uh, foisted upon everybody these days with a whole lot less uh, reward coming back in uh and a whole lot uh, of question marks as to job security and economy and all that business these days. These are very difficult and difficult times. So important times to take care of your spirit, your mind, your body. Important times to think about what goes in your body. And we're going to talk a little bit about that right now. You know, when you talk about the idea of managing stress, you really can make a difference. You can lessen your body's negative reactions to stress, and that's really what good nutrition should be helpful uh, with, and is helpful about. So when you think about the most important thing, we're talking about not 
contributing to the negatives. In other words, when you're producing stress hormones, such as an excessive high amount of uh, cortisol, aldosterone, epinephrine, all these stress hormones, there are 45 in particular that uh, we tend to drive up during periods of acute stress and tension. And uh, it's not necessarily uh, a slam dunk that you really have to experience that. Uh, just because your body's become accustomed to experience those stress hormones doesn't mean you have to get uh, sort of trapped into that notion that that's normal. It's not. It doesn't have to be. It all begins with uh, your thinking, your mind, and uh, of course, to keep your mind in a balanced stress-free zone is really an important process. It's uh, extremely important to exercise your mind and your brain in those manners and to just really keep working at it. It's not an easy thing to do, but it's essential to do. From the nutritional perspective, I think one of the things you can do to help yourself to do that very thing is to alkalize yourself. We talk about alkalization quite often here on the Natural Health Show. And uh, alkalization is really key because alkalization will really increase the amount of oxygen that's delivered at a cellular level. We tell people that uh, when you take things like liquid chlorophyll, you take uh, two tablespoons of liquid chlorophyll three times a day in water, uh, you will dramatically increase the delivery of alkalinity to your cells and of course that's going to increase the amount of oxygenation. I always tell people that when you think about checking your first morning's urine, if that first morning's urine is extremely low in the pH range, 5.5, 5.0, too low. And every tenth of a point that you can bring that urine up in pH, every tenth of a point is equal to 64.9 percent oxygen <laughs> differential. So once again, why why asphyxiate your cells? Why deprive your cells of oxygen during periods of acute stress? So the objective really is to keep your body as alkaline as possible. Liquid chlorophyll is an extremely helpful way to do that very thing. And uh, again, you know, I think that uh, it doesn't take a whole lot to make a great difference. The more alkaline your body is, the less you will feel the ravages of stress at a cellular level. So a lot of folks, of course, over the years have uh, reported into us, a lot of folks that we've counseled and worked with have said, wow, big difference. You know, the stress isn't any different, but the manner in which my body and my brain are, are functioning in the face of stress is uh, really improving, not notably improving. And I think that you can make a noticeable difference by simply alkalizing, and that's uh, a really important process. My theory is it takes no more than 21 days to really shift your alkalization process, to go from a very acidic, stress-based chemistry into more of an alkaline stress-free chemistry. And uh, those cellular changes are going to make big, big differences at all levels. Uh, also diet, you know, one of the things I always recommend is that you avoid the very acidic type food intake. So a lot of the coffees and sugars and alcohols that people kind of get stuck with, they sort of get patterned into those things. In other words, they take the alcohol, like we said, very heavily on weekends to kind of forget about their, their, their pain, their difficulties, and their stresses. Uh, but you're only contributing to the problem long term. And as you feel exhausted and energy uh, depleted, you end up looking to caffeine to, to bring you back the other way. So you're in that sort of high-low business. And uh, that that spike and crash uh, curve is not going to help you recover from stress. It keeps you locked into it. The objective is to break out of it. The objective is to uh, really shock your system in a way, in a, in a very positive and a healthy way, through alkalization. So, uh, number one, when we talk about uh, defeating stress at a biochemical level, it's really all about alkalization. And uh, let's see here, we're going to get you uh, calling in here too. And the number's in Boston and New England, 617 822 1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call pound at 96.9. We'll take your questions regarding natural health issues of any sort, but we are talking with you this evening about stress and burnout. Real important issue, again, a Harris survey suggests that 75% of us are that very thing, stressed and burned out. Well, my message this evening is you don't have to be stressed and burned out. You know, again, like we said, stress is natural to some extent, but when it, when it becomes unmanageable and out of control and the dominoes start rolling up on you, uh, it becomes virtually impossible to manage. And I think that's the real key, keeping it at a manageable level. One of the most important factors for doing that is alkalization. 
alkalization. There are some really important supplements that can help support the nervous system as well. We're going to talk about those shortly. But the real key, first and foremost, is stop creating this, this stress environment at a cellular level. So, you know, again, you're into this into this vacuum that you've kind of created where you feel stress, you need to kind of uh, alcohol yourself and, and drug yourself, and then you move into a different direction altogether, and you caffeinate yourself to kind of counteract it. Sugar is an important part of that process as well. People are not efficient with regards to their their glucose levels. Again, they're wiped out. They're exhausted. So what do they do? They basically un end up, uh, unfortunately, trying to make the difference up with sugar as a stimulant and caffeine as a stimulant as well. So again, to avoid the peaks and valleys, to avoid those extremes, and to find your way into a balanced pH, that is the solution. That will snap you out of it. It will take 21 days. Well worth the effort. So avoiding the caffeine, the sugar, the alcohol, the white flour, the highly processed foods and to increase the amounts of uh, the uh, fruits and vegetables and make sure you're getting those uh, foods that are very rich in magnesium, potassium, all those electrolytes, extremely vital to this process of recovery. They are the things that buffer your pH. They are the very things that will alkalize you. So fruits, vegetables, extremely important. I say make them organic. I always point to the study that was done at the uh, University of California at Berkeley that suggested that Organic produce is as much as 98% richer in nutrients than non-organic produce. 98%. So what is the point? I mean, the point is to increase the nutrients in your system will make it easier for you to protect and defend your cells from the ravages of stress. Make it easier for your mind so you can actually make it easier on your mind through your body. What is magnesium? It's a nerve tranquilizer, folks. Uh, so I, I think it's really important to find more, more elevated levels of magnesium in your foods. It's all about fruits and vegetables. It's also all about really lean proteins, lean poultry, Again, high quality, you want, uh, you want uh, free-range type poultries. You also want to use an abundance of fish. You want to use more beans and legumes in the diet. A lot more magnesium in those foods. And again, the key is to increase the nutrients to protect the cell and to really shock the system, shock the system in a positive way out of that very acidic state where it's so susceptible to the ravages of stress and burnout. So number one, we want to alkalize, like we said, by cutting out the coffee, the sugar, the alcohol, the processed foods, increase the lean proteins, fruits, vegetables, and make sure you're alkalizing even further with two tablespoons of liquid chlorophyll three times a day to make sure you're buffering your chemistry. Very, very important. So pH is numero uno when it comes to offsetting the ravages of stress and burnout at a nutritional level. Again, the numbers in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call pound 96.9. And, uh, you know, it's also important to think in terms of that nervous system. You know, we talk about uh, so many folks laying off caffeine and what ends up happening after depending upon things like caffeine is they tend to find that they get very... Uh, exhausted energetically. They're, they're so dependent upon the sugar and the caffeine that when they withdraw from those things, they get wiped out. So the exhaustion that comes from the withdrawal is something that uh, people need to know it only lasts about five days. So it's, it's no longer than five days in most cases. So it's five difficult days, well worth the effort once you do turn the corner. And uh, you'll find your own natural glucose as opposed to, you know, getting that bump off caffeine. So you have glucose to provide you with fuel. That's your own natural body giddy-up. And to make it more cellularly available will make all the difference in the world. But uh, again, I think that it's really important to think in terms of trying to beef up your nutrient supply what I call nutrification, to nutrify your cells, to nutrify your body, will make all the difference in the world. All right, we're going to take a short little break. And again, our numbers in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless uses free call, just dial pound 96.9. We're here to take your calls on any natural health issues. We're here talking about stress and burnout. Stay right where you are. 
questioning authority is a Boston tradition. And the tradition lives on right here. Any questions? 96.9 Boston Talks. You know, when most people hear the word allergies, they think only of hay fever-like symptoms associated with airborne pollen, dust, and mold. But did you know that many experts estimate that between 60 and 80 million of us suffer from immune-related food allergies without even knowing it? Furthermore, food allergies often contribute to serious health problems such as autism, irritable bowel syndrome, ADD, headaches, and chronic ear infections. Now, there's an effective way to identify and eliminate both your food allergies and the troubling symptoms that they aggravate. Halitest Medical Labs at foodallergy.com offers a full complement of clinical, environmental, and food allergy testing to help you get to the root of your allergy problems. Halitest also provides you with a comprehensive rotation diet, lifestyle booklet, and a wallet card to help you live food allergy-free and stress-free. Do you wonder if you or your loved ones are among the 60 to 80 million food allergy sufferers in America? If so, log on to Halitest Medical Labs, foodallergy.com. Talk to your doctor about ordering a food allergy test from Halitest Medical Labs today. Food allergy Com. Make sure the food you're eating isn't what's depleting you. Make plans now for a day with Joan Borisinko. Hear Joan Borisinko Sunday, August 7th at the Holiday Inn in Rockland. The program begins at 2 p.m. Joan Borisinko is acknowledged as one of the world's greatest leaders and distinguished pioneers in integrative medicine and the mind-body connection. Joan Borisinko's groundbreaking book, Minding the Body, Mending the Mind, revolutionized awareness of the mind-body connection a few years back. Now, Joan's new book, Fried, Why You Burn Out and How to Thrive, is here. Joan will share spiritual inspiration in a unique presentation, Reviving Your Life, with a book signing to follow. Register for Joan Borisenko. Log on to MyHealthyLivingMag.com. General admission is just $39. Call 781-834-2728 for tickets. 781-834-2728. See Joan Borisenko live Sunday, August 7th at the Holiday Inn in Rockland, Mass. Register online at MyHealthyLivingMag.com. MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Do you own or manage a natural health, fitness, day spa, or go green business? Perhaps you have a unique restaurant that offers healthy entrees, heart-smart seafood, vegetarian or lighter fare options. I invite you to share your vision and deliver your message directly to health-conscious New Englanders by becoming a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, New England's number one health radio show. The Natural Health Show is now welcoming potential sponsors to join our natural health family by offering a number of creative and flexible sponsorship packages. For information on how to become a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, simply call Candida at 781-834-2728. That's 781-834-2728. Be a part of New England's natural health revolution. Join our Natural Health Show family today. Now, back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. In Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless, pound 96.9 free call. And let's get to uh, some of these calls now. Sue from Northborough, who has a question about vitamin C. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talk here on the Natural Health Show. Hi, thanks so much. Pleasure. I have two questions. Mm-hmm, um, number one is vitamin C. Yep. Um, hear a lot of things about vitamin C. What's a good dose? Is it even useful? Do you need rose hips? Do you need ester C? Um, I'm actually looking for a dose for a 14 year old or a good multivitamin. Yeah. Okay. Well, first things first. I, I think vitamin C is for real. I mean, if you pay attention to the research of uh, the great Dr. Linus Pauling, and Dr. Linus Pauling, of course, was a Nobel Prize winner and uh, did a lot of his research at Oregon State and, uh, you know, some remarkable research indeed. But, uh, you know, I remember an interview with Dr. Pauling quite some time ago. And again, here's a uh, two-time Nobel Prize winner who said uh, whenever he wanted to think in terms of preventing sickness, he would take, uh, he takes 10 grams, 10,000 milligrams of vitamin C a day he took to prevent illness and to uh, defeat illness once once he did get sick, if ever he did, he would take 20,000 milligrams. Now, I'm not recommending that. I don't do that myself, and I never recommend right. anybody do that, but I think it stretches the point anyway a bit that a two-time Nobel Prize winner thought quite a bit of the uh, vitamins, so that's that's good enough for me. Uh, so the other thing I think, too, is there, you bring up a great point. There are many different types of vitamin C. I recommend vitamin C complete, like or a vitamin C complex, because vitamin C without vitamin P 
is really not as useful in my opinion. Vitamin P is something that's rarely talked about, but you know, I would say that when you think about an orange or grapefruit, nat right. nature really made this this uh, tandem, this team of these two nutrients that work together. And when you think about the vitamin C inside that great orange or that grapefruit, we all know that, as I just pointed out, that that's a great antioxidant. But also in the little, uh, the pulp, the white stuff that we all take great pains to peel off of the orange and the, and the grapefruit, or in the core, the pulp of the orange or grapefruit, that is vitamin P, citrus bioflavonoids, very powerful antioxidants that have a number of great immune responsibilities among them. They help us with histamine production for allergies, uh, but to me the most valuable thing that they provide is the ability to insulate and strengthen the lumen capillary, which, yeah. which means that it protects us against you know, hemorrhaging and, and capillary rupturing, folks who are concerned about, uh, you know, bruising or, God forbid, things like uh, stroke, etc. I mean, these are really empower empowering agents. So right. I say a C-complete. I like the, um, the complexes. Make sure your vitamin C has the vitamin P or what, what are called bioflavonoids with, with them in the uh, formula. That's number one. Number two, for a 14-year-old, yeah, you're probably talking about 500 milligrams. I don't think you need to go much higher than that. Okay. And, get, pl and so, get plenty of it in your food, of course, right? Well, you know, for a 14-year-old, it's pizza, cheeseburgers, and <laughs> trying to get them away from the soda. Yeah, it's I rough. hear you. I but hear you. he is totally, um, I, he's having some kind of allergic reaction, I, and I think it's to all this over-processed food. If I could get more vegetables into him, you know, that would be a godsend. Yeah, but, well, my theory is the germ used to be the main thing we worried about. Now it's the food. Yeah, it's so is the food. And there is, a, is there any good chewable vitamin you recommend just to get the B complex and the I know that then you'd be talking manufacturers. I don't know if you can do that on the well, air. Well, no, that's but. all right. No, that's not a problem. In fact, we have some great sponsors. I mean, Jaro Formulas is one of our great sponsors, and uh, uh -huh. indeed they have a great, great uh, multi. Yeah, there's a number of different companies that make great multis. I mean, Jaro Formulas is top of the top of the list, and I think also Solgar does a great job. NOW, another really good company. Um, Life Extension, great company. Yeah, those are all really, really good companies. You can't beat okay. those companies. Okay. All right. All right. Hey, Good thanks for know. calling. Good luck with that 14-year-old. Thanks so much. All right. Keep giving him bye -bye. oranges, too. Bye-bye. Let's go to uh, Donna on the line from New Hampshire. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talks. You're on the Natural Health Show. Hi. Um, well, basically, my question is, I did, about two years ago, cut out all the caffeine, mm -hmm. and I cut out the coffee and, the, you know, the sugar with the coffee, but there's so much sugar in, uh, like, processed foods yep. that it's, it's hard to cut it out. Okay. And, um, I, I unfortunately, you know, I, I eat very poorly because I work from uh, noon to eight at night. Mm -hmm. So by the time I get home at night at nine o'clock, the first thing I want to do is just pop something into a microwave. Sure. You know, but my, my real question is that I have severe dry mouth. Okay. I have you, uh, now I thought I cut out all of the bad, uh, you know, uh, you know, things that were Yeah, you, you got rid of the sugar and the caffeine, and yeah. you're wondering why you have dry mouth. Right. I, I have severe, like, burn mouth. Yep. Is there, uh, is there a, uh, okay, well, let me tell you, I am on an antidepressant. Yep. And I am on a, uh anxiety, uh, anxiety medication. Okay. So I, I take clonazepam, and I do take Cymbalta. Mm-hmm. So, um... What do I do? I mean, well, I went to see every kind of doctor, yeah. and everybody's like saying N nothing. Well, I can tell you what I think. Okay. Uh, you know, when you talk about, you said you have a, a dry, burning mouth. You know, it's like uh, there's no question about the fact that uh, Western medicine and science and technology have really uh, provided the world with some remarkable solutions in many in many counts regarding healthcare. But you know, uh, ancient Oriental medicine also has a great deal to contribute from time to time as well, and you can learn from both sides of the ocean a great deal about natural medicine. But mm -hmm. I would say one of the great things that you learn from Oriental medicine, traditional. 
Chinese medicine is that when you think about dry and heat like you're talking about, you're talking about a sort of inflammatory response. So, right. so in other words, any time there's any kind of dryness and heat like that, there's an inflammation that's taking place in the body. Well, I would tell you this. I would say that if your mouth is dry and hot like that, even after cutting out caffeine and sugar, which is a great thing, by the way. I think you did the, did the right thing. You just haven't done enough of the right things. I think you also need to alkalize yourself because when you think about alkalization, like I said earlier, alkalization is Mother Nature's way to buffer acidity and to kind of offset the the ravages of inflammation. So the, the number one thing I would do is I would think about supplementing my diet with two tablespoons of liquid chlorophyll in four ounces of water three times a day. I would also, like I said, dietarily, not just worry about what you cut out, but think in terms of what you're adding in or what you're doing. Uh, make sure your diet is very alkaline. A lot of vegetables, a lot of fruits, a lot of salads. I wouldn't recommend the use of vinegar, obviously, uh, but, no, I don't. but I'd recommend lemon and olive oil in those salads. And just to really see if you can't increase uh, your body's natural hydration response by freeing up the hydration response at a cellular level. And of course, that means by alkalizing yourself. So I'd say if you alkalize dietarily and supplement-wise like we just uh, recommended, I think you'll see, you'll see a big difference. 21 days, three weeks. What about green cheese and, um, you know, yep. is, is that good for you, a natural green, or organic green cheese? Yeah, well, again, you know, what I might recommend is, uh, yes, I think there's a lot of uh, remarkable catechins that are great, great antioxidants in the green teas, which are ever so useful. Uh, a lot of wonderful research about uh, the EGCG, epigallocatechin gallate, which is one of the catechin antioxidants in green tea that uh, is helping so many, uh, that it's in many different studies. Studies, it's been found to be helpful with uh, a lot of in these uh, Alzheimer's te uh, studies and a lot of these MS studies, etc. It freeing up a lot of the placking in the brain. So there's no question that there's a really powerful antioxidant food value there in green teas. But uh, you, if you're going to do that again, and you've had uh, hot, dry mouth, uh, warm, dry mouth, you want to make sure that uh, you're alkalizing. Like we said, keep the calf, keep the uh, caffeine out of the green tea. So I would say yes to green tea. Make sure it's decaffeinated. Oh, really? Okay. All right. Because I haven't been doing that. <laughs> you know, and the, and the other thing I would say, too, is that, you know, to some extent, you know, medications that are necessary, such as the ones that you're on, uh, may be helpful in certain ways, but they are by nature very acidic and very acid-producing. So all the more reason to come back around the other way and, like we said, to, to buffer and alkalize yourself while you're on those medications. The more important, uh, the more important thing to do is to, again, alkalize. Where do you buy the liquid chlor uh, chlor chlorophyll? Well, one of our great sponsors, Good Health Natural Foods, of course. Both stores uh, sells the uh, the chlorophyll, and uh, you know, there's World Organic, there's Nature's there's Nature's Way, which is the one that I usually recommend. Is I think Nature's Way is a real good product. Okay. All right. All right. All right. I appreciate all your help. Terrific, Donna. Thanks so much for calling, and good luck. All right. Let's see. Our numbers here in Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, it's just a free call for y'all, and it's a pound 969. A couple things we're going to talk about when we come back from these breathers here, and uh, one of the things we're going to talk about, as promised, we're going to talk about supplements that you can use to support your distressed life. If, again, you're feeling burned out and stressed and overwhelmed, there are some really remarkable, simple solutions on the shelves and the counters at your natural health store. We're going to talk about those when we come back, so stay right where you are. Friend us on Facebook. Link up at 969bostontalks.com. Do you own or manage a natural health, fitness, day spa, or go green business? Perhaps you have a unique restaurant that offers healthy entrees, heart-smart seafood, vegetarian, or lighter fare options. I invite you to share your vision and deliver your message directly to health-conscious New Englanders by becoming a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, New England's number one health radio show. The Natural Health Show is now welcoming potential sponsors to join our natural health family by offering a number of creative and flexible sponsorship packages. For information on how to become a sponsor of The Natural Health Show, simply call Candida at 781 834 2728. That's 781 834 2728. 
Be a part of New England's natural health revolution. Join our Natural Health Show family today. You know, when most people hear the word allergies, they think only of hay fever-like symptoms associated with airborne pollen, dust, and mold. But did you know that many experts estimate that between 60 and 80 million of us suffer from immune-related food allergies without even knowing it? Furthermore, food allergies often contribute to serious health problems such as autism, irritable bowel syndrome, ADD, headaches, and chronic ear infections. Now, there's an effective way to identify and eliminate both your food allergies and the troubling symptoms that they aggravate. Halitest Medical Labs at foodallergy.com offers a full complement of clinical, environmental, and food allergy testing to help you get to the root of your allergy problems. Halitest also provides you with a comprehensive rotation diet, lifestyle booklet, and a wallet card to help you live food allergy-free and stress-free. Do you wonder if you or your loved ones are among the 60 to 80 million food allergy sufferers in America? If so, log on to Halitest Medical Labs, foodallergy.com. Talk to your doctor about ordering a food allergy test from Halitest Medical Labs today. Food allergy. Make sure the food you're eating isn't what's depleting you. Join Joan Borisinko Sunday, August 7th at 2 o'clock at the Holiday Inn in Rockland. Joan Borisinko is acknowledged as one of the world's greatest leaders and distinguished pioneers in integrative medicine and the mind-body connection. Joan Borisinko's groundbreaking book, Minding the Body, Mending the Mind, revolutionized awareness of the mind-body connection. Now, no Joan's new book, Fried, Why You Burn Out and How to Thrive, is here. Joan will share up-to-the-minute spiritual inspiration coming from her own process in a unique presentation. Reviving Your Life. Register for Joan Borisenko at MyHealthyLivingMag.com. General admission is just $39. Program begins at 2 p.m. Call 781-834-2728 for tickets. 781-834-2728. Learn how to revive your own life energy. See Joan Borisinko live Sunday, August 7th at the Holiday Inn in Rockland. Register online at MyHealthyLivingMag.com. MyHealthyLivingMag.com. Now, back to the Natural Health Show, sponsored by Good Health Natural Foods in Quincy and Hanover. In Boston and New England, 617-822-1969. Verizon Wireless users, it's a free call. Just dial pound 96.9. And again, you know, we're talking uh, this evening with you about stress and burnout and virtually anything else you may want to chat about regarding natural health issues. But when it comes to uh, the idea of burnout and stress, again, sometimes it gets a little overwhelming, uh, but there are solutions. There is hope. So not to uh, feel too overwhelmed. There are certainly options. And uh, one of the things I wanted to mention was uh, the importance of a magnesium taurate supplement to those who are really up against it. Uh, Magnesium, first things first, is uh, Mother Nature's, I refer to magnesium often as Mother Nature's natural tranquilizer. And it is that very thing. Magnesium is a nerve tranquilizer. kind of helps us uh, during those periods of extreme tension and stress to kind of cool that nervous system down just a notch or two. And it's a natural way to do so. It's a safe way to do so. And uh, people often ask the question, well, how much is too much when it comes to magnesium? What will happen if I overdose on it? Well, the worst thing that's going to happen if you're taking too much magnesium is you're going to have loose bowel movements. And uh, your body will, will make it very clear that it's had more than, more than its share of magnesium if that's to, uh, the case. So not to worry about that. Number one, you probably want to think in terms of uh, 500 milligrams of magnesium. What kind of magnesium, you may ask? I recommend magnesium taurate, T-A-U-R-A-T-E, taurate, because it's not only magnesium, as we just pointed out, which is Mother Nature's supreme and natural tranquilizer, but there's also taurine, an amino acid called taurine in there. And taurine is a nerve membrane stabilizer. So the two work really, really nicely together. It's a, it's a great formula, and uh, it is called magnesium taurate, T-A-U-R-A-T-E. And uh, like we suggested, about 500 milligrams, you should be in pretty good shape with that. So um, that's real helpful. Good time to take that magnesium taurate really later in the day. So I suggest or recommend that you take about 500 milligrams of magnesium taurate, and uh, perhaps you take the equivalent of 250 late in the afternoon and then another 250 before bed. I'm sorry, uh, 125 and 125 for a 250 total because you're going to get these in 125 milligram caps for the most part. They're not going to come in uh, 250s. They're going to come in 125 milligram caps. So two of the 125s, 4 o'clock in the afternoon, thereabouts, and then another pair of 125s before bedtime. Why? 
One of the single most important things that you want to do for yourself during periods of acute stress is make sure you have recovery at the end of the day. That's called sleep. So what uh, we need here is seven and a half hours of REM sleep, rapid eye movement sleep, real good sleep. is hard to come by, especially during periods of acute stress. That magnesium torate will help make a big difference in that factor. So make sure that you're getting a, uh, a good helping of magnesium later in the day when you're winding down, and uh, again, before bed, when you're really looking to uh, recover from a day of tension and stress, very, very important to get uh, that magnesium later in the day. Also, one of the things that I really like to emphasize is that the idea of sleep is the single most important thing when it comes to what do I take, what do I do for stress. There's nothing more important than ensuring sleep seven and a half hours of REM sleep. That was Mother Nature's solution for you. Nature always uh, has a good has the best solution available. The best solution that nature offered for stress is seven hours and 30 minutes of shut eye. So the magnesium should help that quite a bit. Also, during the daytime, if you're going through a lot of anxiety and tension and stress and worry, there's a wonderful supplement. Again, someone actually uh, brought up green tea. One of the callers earlier brought up green tea. Something called theanine, T-H-E-A-N-I-N-E, theanine. Theanine is something that uh, is essentially, uh, it's obtained from green tea leaves. And it has the ability to, again, just offset the stress intentions of the day. It's a great uh, anxiety queller, a great calmative, if you will. That's called theanine, T-H-E-A-N-I-N-E. The one I like to recommend is the one that is formulated by our great sponsor, Jaro Formulas. You can't beat it. They make a 200 milligram. They make a 100 milligram. Anyway, I recommend that you take the 200 twice. Theanine, T-H-E-A-N-I-N-E. Earlier in the day, so the idea of taking the theanine before you head out the door in the morning, and uh, preferably actually before breakfast, better utilized on an empty stomach. So 200 milligrams of theanine before you head out the door in the morning. Another 200 milligrams of theanine after lunch sometime about 2 o'clock, something like that, midday, 3 o'clock. Again, to try to help you offset some of the anxiety that you may be experiencing uh, throughout the course of a stressful day. So theanine is terrific by day. Also, uh, you know, an awful lot of folks wonder about the mental exhaustion, the fatigue that comes with stress. It's kind of like, you know, the idea that you can't concentrate, you can't remember where you put your car keys, uh, the mind is, is uh, exhausted as well as the body, and the mind seems to have a very difficult time getting on track during periods of acute stress. And uh, so the idea of trying to be efficient at work, efficient at school, uh, being mentally sharp, you know, you can ill afford errors in the world that we live in these days, as we said earlier. Uh, there's more expected of all of us, and there are fewer resources to support us in those endeavors. So extremely important to think about improving your mental focus as well as your mood. Well, there's a great, great supplement that I like to recommend for that. And I often talk about DMAE, dimethylaminoethanol, DM as in Mark, DMAE. And I recommend 200 milligrams, three a day, morning, afternoon, and evening. Uh, when I say evening, I mean later in the day, 5 o'clock, something like that. So one at 7, one at noon, one at 5. Spread them out throughout the day. DMAE will help you as far as elevating your mood and improving your cognitive function. You'll remember where you put the car keys. You'll remember about that important uh, lunch that you had. You'll remember about that important connection that you made with somebody and uh, that phone call that was so important to make, uh, that bill that has to get paid, etc., etc. When your mind is being taken through an awful lot of expectations and uh, there's a lot that you have to contend with throughout the course of a day, you need to be sharp and you need to be of proper mood. That's precisely what DMAE will do. Let's uh, actually get to a caller to here. Let's get to Jen in Mansfield. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talks. You're on the Natural Health Show. Hi, thanks for having me. Pleasure. Um, I had two questions, actually. One is about cholesterol, mm -hmm. and one is about leg cramps. Okay. Um, the first one about cholesterol. About a year ago, I had my cholesterol tested, and mm -hmm. it was my total cholesterol was 257. Yep. Uh, good cholesterol was 45. Triglyceride 76. 
bad cholesterol was 197. Yep. Um, I listened to your show, and you had recommended the Fucoidin. Yes. Um, I started taking that, and I also started taking a red yeast rice supplement. Good, good choices. Um, I retook my blood, uh, my cholesterol levels about three months later, yep. and they actually, my total cholesterol went down to 175. Lordy, that's great. Yeah, good cholesterol went down, though, however, to 37. That's um, not unusual, by the way. You know, let me just explain one thing, if I may just kind of freeze you right there and hold, sure. your, hold your thought. Uh, when I did a lot of corporate consulting, you know, with thousands and thousands of folks, what I learned over the years is that whenever there's a tremendous amount of, uh, of cholesterol that drops like that, and you had quite a drop, quite a significant mm-hmm. drop in, in total cholesterol. Whenever that happens, it's kind of like the baby goes out with the bathwater initially, and it has to rebound, uh, because okay. it, it's all sort of, uh, it's all composited together. So when you lose a mass of lipids like that, you know, the bad stuff is going to ensconce itself and wrap itself around a lot of good stuff and take it out with it. Mm-hmm. Uh, and then it takes time invariably to recover those levels of good HDLs, but they'll come back. Okay, so do you think it's good to just stay with taking the fucoidin and the red yeast rice, or should I be... Yeah, the answer is absolutely yes. I think you're doing the right thing. I think, um, you know, what we noticed, you know, by the thousands, again, we because we looked at so many blood tests that we ran all the time in the corporate groups, and, you know, it's amazing. We'd find invariably that one of the slower-moving things when it comes to uh, lipids is getting those good guys to come up with the HD with regard to HDL. They're a little slow. They really mm-hmm. are. But you stick with it. They will come around. you got to be patient. You know, with losing total cholesterol and getting rid of bad cholesterol, it's a month-by-month proposition, even a week-by-week proposition. Getting good HDL up is more like a six-month-by-six-month proposition. Okay. Um, The only other thing I'd say is make sure you exercise Mm -hmm. and get some fish oils in the picture. I think that's really important as well. Okay. Um, And then my second question was actually my father, he's in his 60s, -hmm. and he suffers a lot from leg cramps at night. Um, I mean, they're really, really excruciating for him. He describes them almost like Charlie horses. He gets several times at night, and Mm -hmm. he says he's talked to his doctor about it. He tried potassium supplements for a while, but that didn't work. No, potassium is the wrong electrolyte. It's magnesium that he's missing. Okay, so you would recommend a magnesium yeah, supplement? Yeah, in fact, um, you know, one of the things we talked about is we talked about the uh, magnesium in the form of taurate, T-A-U-R-A-T-E. Now, the one that he's going to kind of get the most immediate results with re- with regard to cramps, there's a powdered citrate called Natural Calm, C-A-L-M, and uh, you could have him start off with a teaspoon of Natural Calm before bed at night. Now, I'm not sure what his age is, but if he's up there in age, you may notice that that loosens his stools a little bit. If it does, then just switch back to the magnesium taurate and have them start off with 125 milligrams a night. But okay. again, I'd recommend a teaspoon of the natural calm, which you can find at the health food store, because I think that's going to help them almost immediately, right away. Okay, and that's powdered citrate, you said? It is natural a powdered calm. magnesium citrate. They make flavored uh, citrate powders that are raspberry flavored, orange flavored, etc. They work great. Okay, and then, I'm sorry, the other one you said, if that causes loose stools, do the magnesium taurate 125. Yeah, 125, T-A-U-R-A-T-E, and you'd have to be more patient with that one. Again, that, that may take him two weeks or so to really, to really notice the difference, but, you know, if he, if he uh, gets onto this natural calm and doesn't have any loose stools with it, which is probably the case, I'm sure it'll, it'll be, I'm, I'm really confident it'll be okay, and if it is, he'll get results ASAP. Okay, wonderful. All Thank right. you so much. Hey, Jen, thanks for calling. Have a great day. Okay, you too. All right, thanks. Bye. Bye-bye. All right, so uh, to, to finish up where we were here, again, DMAE, 200 milligrams for stress, again, three times a day. And finally, uh, if energy is physiologically not available, if you're just wiped out of energy physically, uh, very important to add. One of, one of my favorite uh, supplements is ribose, R-I-B-O-S-E. My favorite type of ribose is the Jaro formulas, not just because they're our sponsors, because I think it is the best formulated, and that's why they're our sponsors. <laughs> So, the ribose made by Jaro Formula is 2,200 milligrams per scoop. Now, don't get nervous when I say scoop, folks, because we're talking about a thimble the size of your pinky. So, it's a little tiny, tiny scoop, and it blends in water quite easily, and it has a great, great flavor. It's just a little hint of sweetness to it. It's a safe sugar. It's not a bad sugar. It's only one gram of sugar, and it's basically not a negative sugar. It's not a, it's not a bad sugar. It's actually a really good energetic sugar, and it's one that the body makes immediate use of, and wow, great, great energy there. So one scoop three times a day, that's uh, 2,200 milligrams 
three times a day. That's jar of formulas, ribose, R-I-B-O-S-E. Uh, the only other thing I wanted to mention here is that for those folks who have real serious mood problems as a result of their tension and stress. We're not talking about severe clinical depression. We're talking about the blues. We're talking about negative mood response uh, from the tensions and stresses of burnout, etc. And that's not uncommon, unfortunately. But there is a natural solution. There's one that I really have had great success with a lot of folks. It's called 5-HTP. It's hydroxytryptophan HTP, 5-HTP. And I'd recommend uh, 50 milligrams three times a day on an empty stomach throughout the day. Real important notes. Okay, we're going to take a call, and then I'm going to probably have to kind of disappear pretty quickly. But we got Virginia in line from Somerville. Welcome to 96.9 Boston Talks here on the Natural Health Show. Hi. How are you? Um, hi. I wanted to um, ask you about B12. Sure. Um, my mom's almost 80, and uh, she tells me she feels really tired, and she thinks that the reason may be that she doesn't get enough B12. Do you have any recommendations? Yeah, I do, and I think your your mom is very insightful, <laughs> because indeed a lot of folks who are quite exhausted, especially of, of elderly nature, uh, are indeed deficient in vitamin B12. So uh, a safe way to go about doing that is uh, Jaro Formulas, again, makes a methyl, M-E-T-H-Y-L. The methyl B12 is, is sublingual. It's quite easily absorbed, and uh, I would just recommend 1,000 MCGs, which is pretty much a standard dose. So 1,000 micrograms of Jaro Formulas Methyl B12. The methyl, M-E-T-H-Y-L, is the only one that's going to support the nervous system. So I'd say the methyl is real important. So 1,000 micrograms a day? That's correct. Okay. And I, thank you. And I also had a question about myself. Um, okay, we're going to make it quick. Uh, hurry. Oh. Oh, okay. I have uh, a problem with my nails. So my nails, uh, I have these vertical ridges, and yep. I don't know. Um, do you have any recommendations for that? Yes, I'd recommend 50 milligrams of zinc gluconate a day, and you're going to have to give that about six months. You've got to be real patient. That doesn't, uh, does, that's not going to be uh, go, go away overnight, so be real patient with that. But, yes, that's the way I go. Okay, thank you very much. Hey, pleasure. Thank you so much. Appreciate it, and we appreciate everybody calling in here on the Natural Health Show. So, again, each and every Sunday, uh, your calls are more than welcome. And, of course, we'd like to thank uh, all the great assistants we have here that make this show possible. We'd like to thank uh, producer Mike Roberts, intern Alex Todorovic, podcast meister Adam Ng. Folks want to catch any of these broadcasts or any of my Fox 25 segments, go to our website, maxhealing.com. Just one word, pretty easy, maxhealing.com. Dot com. And be sure also to uh, make sure that you stay tuned for Woody and Abby and the gang at uh, Right Turn Radio, New England's number one addiction program. And uh, I will be on Fox 25 this coming Thursday, so that will be at 8.50 in the morning. And uh, that is my Living Well segment. Until next week, until next Sunday, actually, at 5 o'clock, this is Mark Mincola reminding you all, please, be wise, be aware, be well, make it a healthy week. Good night.